Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Let's Open Some Packs. Uh, today, I actually have a uh, special here. Uh, it's not too special, I guess, uh, but it is special because I didn't know they existed. I actually found out about these. Oh, before I continue, I'm doing a series on plastic playing cards, and this is the final deck. There's one or two more that I might do, but I don't think I'm going to because I think I've done enough, and I'll show you what I've gone through. Um, I've gone through uh, Monaco Elites, which is the most recent one, uh, Teskir, uh, we did KEM, and this one, by the way, I did with a really bad camera. Super sorry about that. Uh, I got a newer camera now that looks a lot crisper and you can see more details. So I'm gonna, when I do the final video that goes over all of them, I will, you'll see more of the deck. Uh, I did the Modiano Platinum Edition, and I did some Copags. Uh, I did two sets of Copags because they were so affordable. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna do these, and then I'm gonna do a comparison video. That's the next video. Um, if I don't end up getting the other decks, which I don't think I will, because I have too many now, I think. I have enough to last me a lifetime. Oh, and I also made my own deck, which I will post a link before uh, in the, uh, the description or whatever. Yeah, this is my deck, and uh, I have a deck. <laughs> anyway, so um, let's see. Bicycle Prestige, I didn't know these existed. Oh, before we start, this is going to be a good one. So I made a cup of coffee, which I'm going to take a sip of right now. Why don't I show you the uh, the case there? Look at how nice that is. This is probably one of the nicest cases. Mmm. Coffee's delicious. Anyway, so I got the set, which is not really a set because they're individual. Uh, but the person selling them was like, you can get the set, a red and a blue. Now, I found out about these by, uh, I was looking at um, somebody's was at Walmart and they posted a picture of a deck they saw there. And they were like, I can't believe this is for sale at Walmart. And then underneath at the very bottom, like I didn't even care about the deck they were posting about, I saw this and I was like, wait, what? How come I haven't seen this? I've been doing research on plastic playing cards. No idea the bicycle was in the game. Oh, and by the way, they own Chem now from what I've heard. I think the United States Playing Card Company bought these this company here um so you can buy those from the bicycle website so if you're looking for chem cards you can get them on amazon and you can also get them at the uh, bicycle website so let's leave this out just in case we need it but yeah so um i was super stoked the case is giant this case actually reminds me of um a case that you get with the pen and teller deck if you don't know who pen and teller are they're they're magicians and they uh they have a if you go to their show in vegas um oh, i'm gonna start with the blue by the way or should we start with, let's start with the red. I always, I don't know, I like red a lot. I like starting with red. Uh, but yeah, so they have a show and they have this deck, their very own deck that you could buy there. And it looks like this. I was like, oh, that looks like the Penn and Teller deck. Um, similar at least, maybe not the same. But yeah, this is uh, amazing. I saw them in that picture and I was like, what? Uh, I gotta get some. Um, never even seen these before. Maybe y'all have. I. And I go to Walmart all the time, too. And I go to Target and everything. I've never seen these. Are they new? Maybe, maybe not. Oh, cool. But look at that. Okay, so Prestige Rider Back, okay? And they're plastic playing cards. So let's look at that case there. Look at that. And this is the red one. Let me open this one, too. Um, so we don't get, like, we don't get sidetracked later. Because you know how I like to start something. And then I don't finish it. I don't start, I keep talking like, oh, you know, there's a story, and then I just change the subject. I'm really sorry about that. Uh, this is not scripted, as you can tell. Totally a natura, or however you say that. Okay, so we have blue and red. Um, I'll take this off. I bet you the little crown on this one's going to be blue. Huh? Let's bet. Let's bet. Yeah, that's cool. Loving the case, though. These look really classy. They have nice texture. Uh, pretty simple. Um, yeah, so let's start with the red. Cool, comes right out. Oh, and they're individually wrapped inside. Pretty neat. I think I'm gonna keep these um, when I storm with the other cards. Cool, and it's a rider back. Um, here, let me make sure I use, I don't wanna mess these up. And this knife isn't that sharp anymore. If I ever mess up a deck, I'm sorry. I hope I don't. All right, so we have this is the Rider Back, which if you don't know, is probably the coolest 
back design because you can do magic with these and everybody trusts you. They're like, oh yeah, that's the rider back. It's not a it's not a gimmick deck or anything. Which they do make gimmick decks. Okay, so this is uh Yeah, okay. Just a little ad card here. Um I'm gonna guess they gave us that's your standard bicycle ace as well. Love it. Standard quartz, standard pips, love it. This is great. And by the way, I can already tell these are gonna be good. I'm gonna say these probably feel like chem cards. I can already tell they're gonna feel good. I'm gonna do a little, let me go through, make sure there's nothing special in here. We have the two standard. Oh, they give you, uh, they don't give you duplicate jokers. That's cool. That's a good thing. Okay, here we go. I like that. Some people like duplicates. Um, these feel, I can already tell you they're, yep, these feel like the chem. If you already got the chem, good for you. Uh, are these plastic acetate? Because I know that's what chem is. And someone posted in one of the other, um, I don't see it here. Maybe it is. Anyways, um, they feel really good. If you're wondering, they and it even says in here, shuffles like a dream. Performs and shuffles like a dream. These, get, these smell a little plasticky though, which tells me they might not be what I just said. Maybe more similar to Copag. And I might take that, I might, I might have to do some take backs on um, feeling like, uh, did I drop them all? Feeling like the chem cards. These don't feel as soft. So they, they're, as, they're as bendable, but not as soft. And they smell a little bit. So I'm gonna say they're a little bit more similar to the Copag. But we'll, like I said, we're gonna do this final review of all of the cards. Oh yeah, that doesn't feel as smooth as I thought it would. Maybe that was me though. Let's not blame the cards. Man, they're incredibly, holy moly. Let me see, I just dropped the cart. <laughs> I'm getting too old for this. All right, so here we go. Okay, so they shuffle really well. Spring a little interesting. Let's look at the blue ones. And they're incredible. You see how they're just going all over the place? They shouldn't do that in my mind because they're, they're very, they have a rough texture to them. Uh oh, hey, there you are. Okay, so, cool. Okay, so not too bad and not too good yet. Um, same ad card. This is kind of a cool, I wonder if you could practice. Wow, you could really practice palming with this because it won't, you know, it's plastic. You can go, hey, is this your card? Um, Cool, cool, same. I'm assuming they're all the same on the inside. Yeah, you see how they're just flying all over the place? I'm not sure if you've seen my other videos. They don't do it, they don't do that too often. Um, yeah, this is the blue rider back. And it's called the rider back because the little, the, little, the little cherub thing is riding a little, like a little, it looks like a, it looks like a little, a unicycle. Um, it looks like more like a pogo stick. Yeah, these feel like the same. Even though I'm doing the move a little bit better. Uh, but see how they, fl they shoot everywhere? That's crazy. The other cards didn't do that. Did I drop more on the ground? <laughs> they went flying earlier. All right, so um, yeah, okay. So I'm gonna say this is it's, it's a good value. This is probably, one of these is 10 bucks. 9.99 online. Um, good price for one, and you get the rider back, so everyone's gonna like recognize them which is a really good thing, in my opinion. Um, let's get the jokers out. The deck feels much. I can feel the thickness of the, of the deck. You know something I haven't tried with these? Is this. I haven't tried. Okay, that, that feels, doesn't feel like a regular deck of cards. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, not really for magic and like flourishes and all that. Um, and fanning and yeah, see it's, I can't fan that good anyways, so. They're more for like, I think like shuffling. Like you're playing some card games with friends and family. With other decks, you gotta break them in, you know? Uh, and they're good for peeking too. So when you're playing poker, you wanna, you wanna peek. The card doesn't get, if you peek with regular cards a lot, you'll start to get a bend here. Uh, they bend really easy. And some people are really like, they just have strong hands. You know what I'm talking about? You're like, let somebody borrow something like, hey, thanks, crash. <laughs> and it's like, whoa, whoa. Or they have really sweaty hands and greasy hands. 
You don't want to do that with a regular deck of cards. That's why I think this is good, because you can just wipe them off, and you're good, you know? Um, yeah, so that's the review. I like these, especially for the price. Ten bucks, and they're bikes? Yeah. Um, I like both colors. They're both vibrant, you can tell. They look great. Um, what do I think? Again, I think they're worth it. I think I think you should get, get some if you can. Uh, if you like bikes, especially. Add them to your collection. And uh, that's the video. Remember, uh, please like, subscribe. I'm going to do a another video, last one on the plastic playing cards. For now, I have some other plastic playing cards coming in, but it's just a single review. It has nothing to do with uh, poker, more about quality and another kind of deck. You'll see. Uh, anyways, that's the video. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you later.